Hey, welcome to Cody the Car Guy. So we've got a broken bolt. This is up on a cool pack set um, for a Montero Sport with the 3.0 motor. So usually what I like to do is I'll grab my welder and a nut like this. I'll stick it on the broken bolt. Put some weld in there. Let it cool down for a little bit. Spray a little bit of a PB blaster in there. And then I'll wiggle it out. Um, you can also sometimes try it with your uh, pair of ice grips and wiggle back and forth. This one wasn't wanting to do anything, and the other thing too is sometimes you can grind it off like that, then you need to start drilling it. I try to weld something, it usually takes me a minute, and it usually works every time. Um, that's the easier way to do it to me because I've always got a welder right by where I'm at. If you don't have a welder available, just grind it flush so you can get a, a good spot for your drill, and then drill it out that way. Just go down, keep going up in sizes until it finally will uh, thread itself out. Um, reverse drill bits are the better way to do it. If you have the other one, you can get to a certain point, then you can use the easy out and kind of wiggle it out. So let's go and get a welder on this one and uh, see if it comes out pretty easily. Now some people say disconnect the battery and all this other stuff and the computer and everything, but I've never had a problem with that before. So I um, went ahead and grounded on the intake, get this about as center as you can be. And uh, I'm going to try to hit that very center bolt and then uh, we're gonna, I'm going to walk the bead up to the uh, nut. Now, we're going to let it cool a little bit, of course, and um, at that point, spray some PB Blaster. I'm going to get a little dose in from underneath, and uh, we'll see if we can get that thing to come out. All right, pretty much at this point, I will take a pair of vice grips, and I'll just start working back and forth a little bit. You're either going to break off where the bolt's welded, or you're going to start to break it free. stubborn. We've got a little bit trying to be movement. Let's see what we got. Oh, there we go. Alright. And just like that, it looks like it's trying to break free. Now you can use a regular wrench on there. I just kind of like uh, the vice grip. Um, gets a good grip on there. It's trying to come out now, just like I thought it would. All right. I like said so now, if you do it this way, it takes a minute to weld. You know, when you got to drill, sometimes it takes a while. So you can change that bit. You got all the metal particles going down there. Um, and this one. Now we're of course, you know. I'm going to go ahead and clean it up with a tap before we put the new bolt in there. Get it is out of there. So that is your broken bolt right there. Um, all welded up. I do this often. This is a uh, pretty you know, common way to get these out for me. Like I said, uh, make sure you clean up with the tap just to be on the safe side. And um, hope you guys enjoyed that. And I'll catch you on the next one. Love any of videos. Oh.